The Yamaha Whitetail Diaries team loves the pursuit of whitetail deer, and it's literally a year-round passion. From the creation of new stands and food plots to the testing of new products, well, they always have a reason to spend time in the field. Some of their most enjoyable efforts recently have been working with Yamaha on providing feedback on various side-by-side -side units and how hunters, ranchers, and outdoorsmen in general use them. When we take to the woods, we demand a product that's going to allow us to get to and from our stands. and It's going to allow us to be comfortable and get back to some of the places that are tough to find because that's where those big bucks live. And when we're filming for Whitetail Diaries, we know while we're out in the field that the Yamaha product line is going to ensure everything that we need. It's going to get us there and get us back with the reliability and dependability that's built into every unit. I'm just seeing the progression with ATVs and side-by-sides has been really miraculous. Uh, when I first started, the biggest uh, four-wheel drive ATV was 400 cc's. Now they go up to 700 cc's and larger. And the biggest trend we're seeing more recently is a lot of consumers are preferring to go to a side-by-side -side vehicle. Uh, North America is the largest market for ATV and side-by-side -side vehicles. We started transferring production to the U.S. about 12 years ago. Um, it started with ATVs and then over time, uh, we built our first side-by-side -side vehicle in the United States. And uh, today we have uh, a majority of our products are assembled right here uh, in the United States in Georgia. When I get ready to head off-road, I want to make sure I've got a vehicle that's got power, but I also want to make sure that I've got comfort to it. I don't want to be jostled around all the time. And, and when I was riding around the Viking 6, that's one of the things that I noticed was its comfort. I also noticed that it's incredible size inside the cabin, whether you're sitting in the back or you're sitting in the front. I mean, as the driver, I had ample leg room, and I've got some pretty long legs out there, and I had plenty of room to be comfortable and sit back and, and not feel crowded in there. And when you put six people in this unit, you're going to be dealing with the same situation due to the offset middle seat, which is allowing that person that sits in the middle to have his own shoulder room because that middle seat is leaned back a little bit. Then when you look at how much clearance this unit has and what you can climb with it and the amount of power to it, you don't have to worry about being underpowered when you've got six people in there and all their gear, whether you're heading you know, down a pipeline, whether you're working on the farm, or you're heading out to your favorite deer stand in the dark. The Yamaha Viking 6 is a unit that's going to provide you with what you need when you head to the field. Yamaha Wolverine is a unit that's really exciting. Uh, it's it's going to provide a great durability, super power, comfortable ride, and the ability to accessorize it to your particular needs. Great two passenger seating that you're going to have your own little room and they're very comfortable in there. A very roomy, you know, space for all your legs and, and to be able to handle. And that unit, it handles like a dream. I mean, it's an aggressive unit. So whether you're, you know, you're using it on the weekends to hunt or you're using it on, as a construction vehicle during the week, whether you're running around the farm or the ranch or you're, you know, just playing with it, going off road, going trail riding and everything, that Wolverine is a very multi purpose, you know, easy to use unit that's going to suit a lot of different people's needs so you know if, if two passenger seating is what you're looking for that Yamaha Wolverine's got it for you.